Hello students, welcome once again and we have um, a question over here. Now find the value of the square root of 6 plus um, the square root of 6 plus the square root of 6. So we have a um, solution here. So we can have, um, so what we are going to do is that we are going to let um, a variable, so let's say let x be equal to um, the square root of 6 multiplied by we have 6 here, then um, another square root here. Alright, so we have that. Right, so we let s be equal to this. Then what about s squared? So s squared will basically be um, the square root of all of this plus um, 6 here. All squared. So when we square that, we have um, s squared being equal to 6 here plus the square root of 6 plus uh, 6 plus so square root of 6 here. That. So we have x and s squared as that. So what we are going to do next is that we are going to um, we are going to uh, substitute the whole of this as x because the whole of this is just representing x so we have um, s squared here equal to 6 here and the whole of this is just x so we have x over here then we have s squared minus x then we have um, sending this to the other side negative 6 equal to 0 so this is what we have now we are going to find two values when we multiply we get negative 6 which is 3 and 2 and when we add this value, we should get negative 1. So we'll put the negative here because negative 3 plus 2 is just plus negative 1. So we have s squared minus 3x here. Then we have positive 2 minus 6. Positive 2x equal to 0. So we can have s squared minus 3x here. Then plus 2x minus 6 here also. So we factorize x how we have x minus 3. Then also we have 2 outside and x minus 3 here equal to 0. So from here we have um, we have x minus 3 here. Then we have plus um, then we have x plus 2 x plus 2 here equal to 0. So x minus 3 equal to 0. Therefore x is equal to 3. Then x plus 2 equal to 0. And therefore s is just um, negative 2. We have negative 2. So now what is the value of x? Now because uh, we can't get um, the square root of a negative value is undefined. Then therefore um, negative 2 is out. Because the square root of negative 2, uh, of negative 2, the square root of negative 2 is undefined. So we have um, s as negative 2 out. And therefore, we have that s is negative 3. Then, therefore, this should tell us that now the square root of 6 plus um, the square root of 6 here. Then multiply by that, square root of that all the way is equal to 3 as our value so we have that being equal to 3 so thank you very much once again and i'll see you in another section have a nice day